Hello Aquarius and welcome to your coffee cup reading for the week ahead of October 21st through the 27th. Hmm. Mm. Okay Aquarius. Remember this is a general reading and oh wow and may not apply to all of you because I you know there's many of you up there so I try to give examples, but what I'm seeing here, there could have been for some of you, I'm gonna explain this in a few ways what I'm seeing, it's very strange, is something has been unclear, there's been some secrecy, something's been concealed, okay? Um, I do see that this could be somebody lied to you, you find out like someone maybe had a baby, was pregnant, didn't even tell you, and you find out a baby was born. That's one way. For others, this could be a loss or um, having uh, fertility issues. Others, this could be... <laughs> you find out someone was adopted you were adopted. Um, there's been some kind of secrecy or something. That's one thing I'm seeing. Okay. I gave you some examples. It doesn't mean it's for everyone. For some of you are dealing with some kind of loss, broken hearted. Maybe um, this was you're pregnant and you had a miscarriage. Um, someone out there, I, I read what I see. So I'm trying to put this together. So I'm seeing that energy as well. Or you've been trying to uh, bring something to life and it, it's been a struggle. I see some kind of loss, heartbreak. This could also be, for some of you, matters of the heart. Um, two's company, three's a crowd. This is um, either um, a three uh, threesome. <laughs> Maybe it is a threesome. But it could be, you know, um, a third person involved. Or this could be cheating. I see also faded energy. Things are a little bit concealed, unclear. There's secrecy. Okay, so I'm seeing this. Some of the for some of you, this is faded energy. It's like maybe something you wanted to start new. It kind of didn't go your way. It's in fertile ground. Um, something is lacking a sense of nurturing. Okay, I see also some of you need to tap in more creatively. I see some of your blocked um, blocked creativity um, or something that you're just beating a dead horse and it's like there's no future development. So I'm seeing a lot of ways this. Okay, now. I do see some of you traveling. This could be someone visiting. This could be also, you know, success is on its way. I do see, again, secrecy. Um, you may be holding some secrets or someone's um, holding some secrets. There's some secrets around you, okay? Some of you may have secret desires, okay? Trust your intuition, your wisdom, and you have a wish and these you're keeping it to yourself. There could be delays with it. This could be wish fulfillment maybe um, around your birthday time. Because I think in a few months, one, two, three, maybe months, two, something like that. Um, it's like you're going to have to make some choice, okay? You're not trusting everything either. There's some trust issues going on. I mean, there's a lot going on here. I do see some of you feeling cast out, feeling left out. Some of you have money worries, okay? Some of you are fighting depression or you're just keeping more to yourself. Know that you are on the right path with some things. Um, trust your intuition. Um, know that the uh, universe is guiding you, Okay. You do have a yes answer to anything I don't answer to. Know that there's a lot of things in the palm of your hands. You can create anything. It's almost like um, the magician energy. If we were looking at tarot cards, it's like a magician energy, okay? But it doesn't come easy, okay? There's some conflicts. Maybe not everybody's going to be on board. You may have conflicts with others. There's um, either competitive energy. This could be also multitasking a lot. Um, a learning experience. There's some changes, maybe some adjustments you have to make. Some things are not easy to manifest. So it's like you're, it's like tweaking some things around too. So adjusting something. So I'm seeing that too. Some of you may be taking a hobby and making a career out of it or making some money, but trying to get it started. I do see some of you need some advice. There is someone who's very supportive. This could be even a mentor around. Um, I do see, again, it's like you're stuck in your head. Um, or you're just kind of seeing tunnel vision and you're not seeing the, you know, the bigger picture. I see some of you dealing with depression. So be careful of that energy as well. It's, it's like sadness, loss or something. 
Um, but I do see also there's a focus on home, family, people that are close to you, happiness all around. Okay, so that is showing up as well. Wow. I see a lot of emotional energy, okay, um, holding things in. Some of you may be dealing with your own pri primal stuff too. Um, some of you may get together with someone, you hide it, I don't know. It's like secret lovers. This could be even getting together, um, getting intimate sexually with someone. I mean, I'm. it's a lot in here, okay? A lot of uh, spiritual energy is coming through here too. Um, you need to tackle some deep-rooted issues, okay? So I see... Some of you may need some counseling. These are psychological things too. Um, maybe talking to someone close to you or someone may be in need of this too. So I mean, I'm seeing this in a lot of way. Um, someone who's very close to you. Maybe you need to speak to someone about something. Um, it's like being unafra unafraid to open up with one another um, is going to help strengthen a bond too. So maybe there's some things like Okay, I have to confess something to you or I have to tell you my true feelings and then the other person too. So I'm seeing that energy coming through too. Wow. Okay, you might find yourself really strategizing this week, like a whole new approach to your big picture goals. This could be with work, professional, school, anything that you, that's major in your life. Um, I do see your status, career, um, things like that are coming into focus. Um, this is really a good time to think about what you really want and what you, what you need to do um, to own the things that you want, your dreams, your wishes, or your goals ahead as well, okay? Um, you may be taking on more responsibilities. Um, maybe you need to sit down and talk to your bosses or whoever can help you manifest this. Um, try to uh, communicate, make a case for either if you're wanting a raise, a promotion, um, that might be in your best interest now as well, okay? So this is the time to kind of do it. So that's one thing I'm seeing here. Wow, there's a lot here. Okay, on your plate, Aquarius. Some of you may have difficulties with a child, okay? That's one thing. Or it's someone who is immature for their age, you know what I mean? Do not believe everything you hear, okay? Because I feel someone is maybe promising you something and they're deliberately lying um, or they know they can't fulfill a promise. Um, they're just trying to get on your good side. You know, like just say you want to fly to France. <laughs> That's your dream. And this person's like, you know, I know somebody. I know someone who's got, um, who can get you there, who can get you tickets really cheap. I have a place. They have a place for someone to stay uh, there. You don't have to pay for a hotel, blah, blah, blah. You know, things like that. The person knows that that's bullshit. But they're telling you for some reason because they want to get on your good side. That's the type of energy I'm seeing. So don't believe everything or any promises that are made. Also, there is an energy here that you may react um, immaturely, have a tantrum about something too. So someone, others around may say, oh, you're overreacting. You're acting like a child. That's another way I can look at this too. Um, some of you, this is just having um, a child maybe deceitful or a child maybe going through a crisis and has um, some kind of issues um, as well. I see hostilities around, okay, and conflicts. This can also be someone aggressively just attacking you, okay, or just saying something or creating some kind of challenges. Um, just don't move backwards, okay? It's like some of you feel like you wasted your journey. You feel like you're uh, falling off your horse. Or you feel a stall of energy, okay? Keep moving forward is the key. That's one thing I see, okay? So moving forward is going to be um, beneficial for you. Like travel, if you need to go out of town, just keep going on your journey. You need to trust the universe. You need to trust that you're being guided. You're making a um, progress, okay? Uh, um, that's another thing. For others, make sure if you're like traveling or something that especially by car, some kind of transportation that um, you check your oil, um, make sure that you, you know, you may have some issues on travel. That's another thing I'm seeing um, as well. Okay. Um, make sure that the people around you, you trust too. So that's another thing I'm seeing as well. I don't know. There's just a lot going on with Aquarius. So I've been trying to explain this every which way I can. Um, yeah. Like I said, it's a general reading, so I try to give every example of what I saw. So it's strong energy, yes, but 
there's, you know, what we were just going through here too, okay? If it doesn't apply to you, doesn't apply, that means that someone's energies out there is very strong. I read what I see and so forth. Well, Aquarius, that was your reading for the week ahead of October 21st through the 27th. I hope you have a wonderful week and I'll catch you back next week for your next coffee cupping. Until then, all the best and bye for now.